I am in the Staten Island Mall, and Newberry Comics just opened up a new store here. So I was going to go check it out. It's a chain on the Northeast. They have a bunch of stores. And I did a review of one in Long Island. And now they're in Staten Island. They're in the city. So let's go check it out and see what kind of books they got, all right? Newberry Comics in the Staten Island Mall. Okay, we are inside. We have breached the walls. The Titans have breached the walls. And we have our jetpacks on. We are defending the city. We got an attack on Titan shirt. They got socks here. Newberry Comics loves their socks. Every store I go to has plenty of socks. All right, and they have... Uh, yeah, Attack on Titan. If you guys haven't seen this, it's pretty awesome. They have those... Uh, they can scale walls. They have those jetpacks. And they have those uh, armaments built into their legs. It's pretty cool. All right, here's the top-selling manga right away. As soon as you walk in, you're confronted. Classroom is number one. Yeah! Look at this. Demon Slayer is number four? The big boy? Yeah! All right, so right away when you walk in, they have all the manga, and uh, they have it listed out. Number one, number two, top-selling. So uh, you're confronted with all the big sellers, and then in the back, there's two more rows of it. Here's Attack on Titan right here. This is excellent. You guys ever check us out? It's a really cool story. Let's do this. And they also have um, all the big ones are here. All the uh, I know I know all the uh, mainstream ones, all the popular ones. And there's two rows here full of uh, Funko Pop. The store is very very minimal, right? Very neat and simple. Very uh, it's like like Japanese, right? Bruh. The layout, little feng shui, more socks. Newberry Comics love socks. I'm sorry about the light. My camera is very sensitive to light. Look at the light blaring in here. So we are Newberry Comics in Staten Island Mall. And it's very neat and minimal. All this Funko Pop. A little safe space here. Leave you plenty of room. A little safe space to make you feel calm. But don't feel nervous. Because Staten Island has a lot of rules. You will be safe here. Let's check out some of the rules they have. Triple kill! No mass shootings. No firearms allowed. In the mall. Okay. All right, so we have the top 10 new arrivals, Funko Pop. And they got two rows of it here. And then there's more uh, manga here. There's, there's like three or four rows here. Akira. People are still reading that? Akira? It's from the 80s? Are you serious? That anime from the 80s? Here's the first Attack on Titans, right? This is the issue of the first volume. Classroom. I'm not even, I'm not even uh, familiar with that classroom. That's number one. Oh, here you go. All you need is kill. This was like the greatest action movie in the past 10 years. You guys see the Tom Cruise movie? That's what they, uh, Edge of Tomorrow was uh, based on that uh, manga. That movie was awesome. It was raging. All right, let's see what else we got here. Bleach, here's another big boy. Blade of the Immortal. Oh, here we go, Death Note for you uh, art house guys. For you cerebral readers out there. And it's written like a little Death Note book. <laughs> it's kind of cool, right? And uh, write your name below. I'll write your name in the book. In the comment section, put your name below. I'll write your name in the book. We'll see what happens. In the comment section, put your name below. And we will see what happens. We will test fate. All right. Uh, let's see what else we got here. We got more uh, Funko Pop and manga over here. They put this right in the front as you walk in. So I guess they're really pushing the... Uh, the uh, Japanese manga and the, uh, here's One Piece here. They get three volumes in one book. Volume one, two, and three. Triple kill! Alright, so it's a uh, comic book store, but they have graphic novels, trade paperbacks, and they have a lot of pop culture stuff. I saw a lot of vinyl and records and music and t-shirts. Pop culture store, kind of.
Uh, you guys watching this, Vinland Saga? This is awesome. I haven't read this, but the anime is on Prime right now, Amazon Prime. It's pretty cool, man. It's like uh, Leif Erikson or Eric the Red. Full Metal Alchemist. This is awesome, too. Where's Berserker? I mean, Berserk. Where's Berserk? All right, here's um, this anime. Even though it says anime, it's only just uh, T-shirts and stuff. They don't have, like, DVDs or anything. Maybe in the future? All right, so it's laid out. Really kind of a neat store. Very straightforward, simple. More socks. I gotta get you socks. And a yoga mat. You guys, If you guys want to do yoga, if you girls out there want to do warrior pose or downward lying dog, you can come in here and do a little yoga session. Do it. Do it. And they have a, what is this, K-pop they have? They sell record players. And they have a K-pop section. Look at this. <laughs> All right, so they have vinyl. If you want vinyl, for you hipsters out there, they have a whole vinyl section. There's some uh, refrigerator magnets. They have a whole vinyl section, a middle section here of records, but it's all uh, classic stuff. And then they have some punk stuff like that. And some uh, greatest hits. All right, here's the comics over here. Oh, here's some pins. And here's some trading cards. You guys out there love their trading cards. We have magic. We have Pokemon cards. <laughs> nice selection of cards here, right? <laughs> For you guys who want to come in here and buy a hundred packs and open them all. There's a Bad Brains record, right? The R-O-I-R -R sessions. I saw the Bad Brains. They were still playing that stuff, too. It was like I against I era. And they were going a little bit raggae, but they were still playing their classic stuff. Um, I saw them in the early days. They were, uh, as they were just becoming raggae at the, uh, I saw them at the Ritz, I think. All right, so here's a good idea. They had the Suicide squad they have a book there they have jupiter's legacy and they had uh, the ultimates this is a good idea. you have a wall here for people coming in who saw just saw other media and want those books you know a lot of comic book stores should try to uh you know um capitalize on the media that comes out jupiter's legacy came out suicide squad has a movie coming out next week put the books out on display and try to time it you know it's a cool idea. Huh? This is kind of an indie book, right, Carmen? It's kind of cool. Seven Secrets down there. I love that book. Yeah. It's still going strong, Seven Secrets. We got uh, The Blue Flame. This is a cool indie. There's a lot of covers for that. Even though it's only issue two, there's like uh, a bunch of covers for it. And what did I come in here for? I was looking for, I guess, uh, Moon Knight has been getting great. Here's Ultimates right here. MCU is based on the Ultimates, isn't it? So they got the Ultimates there, they got Suicide Squad, Jupiter's Legacy. You know, capitalize on the media that's out there for when people come in and want to get reintroduced to comic books again. This is getting a lot of good reviews, Eve. There's the Legend of Dark Knights, Shadecraft is cool. Shadow Man, here we go. This guy's really good, Cullen Bunn. I think he's kind of underrated writer. He's a good writer. Wow! And, uh, yeah, they have a lot of indies here, man. They're indie heavy. A lot of indies and a lot of the uh, big two also. A lot of Marvel DC. All right, you can get a pull list here, they said. You can organize a pull list if you want one. And this store is pretty new. I haven't, I think it's maybe open uh, a month or two. Because I remember last time I was here, I didn't see the store here. All right, so maybe I'll grab this. I'm looking for the Moon Knight. Here it is right here. Because it's been getting great reviews. I mean, they were hurting the guy. They they published so many Moon Knights in the past year. It was the three number ones that came out? But this one's getting really good reviews. But I can't find the regular... Where's the cover A? Are they all sold out? Looks like these are all variants. Is that a variant? Or is that cover A? Or oh, do they have cover A? All right, they have, there's another variant. Because I went to my LCS the other day, and they had they didn't have the regular they only had other covers cover B. I think there's like ten covers for this. You know they're going uh, variant crazy. I don't the cover A I think sold out. 
I don't know what it looked like. All right, so I grabbed the Moon Knight. Really cool character, you know? And I hope this run uh, works out well for him. And I think there's a show coming out too, right? <gasps> so maybe he'll get... Uh, I think this is what? A Noctera, a uh, incentive variant? I think one in 10. Sorry for the glare. I think it was one in 10, Noctera. Sketch cover? Were they on number five? That's cool, they put out the incentive uh, variants. That's pretty cool. All right, I'll only grab a couple of books. Yes! Seven Seekers, look at that cover, it's awesome. This book's awesome, man. Tom Taylor run? He's a real page turner. I mean, I'm into like every issue. I have this already though, but I don't have that cover. Oh my God, who the hell cares? Should I grab this Noctera? Bruh. All right, let's see what else we got here. We got uh, that Skybound book. <coughs> Undiscovered Country is sitting in here. <coughs> All right, and to the left, we have some graphic novels and some trade paperbacks. That section is actually crowded. A lot of people over there. And we have uh, some Star Wars books here too, right? Yeah, this section over here is some Dogman, uh, some YA, young adult over here. Dogman and Captain Underpants. All right, so it's kind of a neat store. They got a nice big space here. Nice and big. And I'm not sure how many of these are. Let me know in the comments below how many uh, Newberry comics there are. I think there's 15 of them. Is it 15 or 16? But they're mainly a, a New England chain. And now they are in uh, New York as well. And uh, say com local comic shops are having a hard time, but this place is booming. They're opening stores. <laughs> Spreading out. I has like a uh, graphic novel section and a trade payback section. You got a Fantastic Four, Watchmen. It's crowded over here. There's a bunch of people over here. Oh, this guy's getting Batman Year One. Yes, good choice. All right, and then they also have a lot of pop culture stuff. So they have a lot of music T-shirts, band T-shirts, and like I said, they have uh, vinyl in the middle rows. I don't have time to go through all that vinyl stuff. And they have some, uh, not really statues, but they have some uh, statuettes and stuff. And uh, these are some regular novels, like Stephen King kind of novels. And they have some posters in here. They have some, uh, look at this Batman uh, artwork. They have some like horror posters and uh, classic uh, cult posters. They have uh, music posters, the gorillas. All right, and we got some music tees. And uh, Hot Topic is like two stores over. They're going to get hurt by this, no? This is a lot of Hot Topic stuff. Look at this, all these t-shirts. I think it's like two stores away. A little competition here. Ah! The Staten Island Mall is getting very hipster, right? Got a Newberry Comics, got a Hot Topic. What's going on here? Once they have a uh, Doc Martin shop, it's over. <laughs> All right, so here's a um, more t-shirts, more socks, right? You really like the socks, little socks. <laughs> All right, and they have some uh, CDs in the back, uh, but mostly they have a lot of vinyl in the middle row here. We got these two islands of vinyl, a lot of classic stuff, some punk. All right, let me go to the front and buy my uh, books here. And the games was uh, board games. It wasn't really video games. It was like board games. They had classic board games. And they have some teddy bears. All right, let me go to the front and buy my comics. My guy, so the store is very big, a nice size. Nice looking store. And you want to see me buy my comics, come to the front here. Thank you so much for watching. Check out my other videos, like and subscribe. Um, and if you want to watch me go to the front here, watch me pay here. <laughs>